Reykjavik. I am super excited today because we are doing a food tour. Um, that's something I learned from Nancy Stern. You should do it like early on and discover like all the best local foods and where they are and keep eating them. So um, we have five stops. I'm gonna take you along and show you everything that we're gonna be eating. So, bon appetit. We had this salmon and char, which is kind of fish. It was amazing. Um, Iceland is famous for hot dogs. First fast food place, see it right there. And the hot dogs are made of lamb. They, apparently Icelandic people love different toppings. So this one has ketchup, kind of mustard, some kind of onions, two kinds of onions, I think. So I'm not a huge um, hot dog person, but one in Iceland, right? So let's, let's try. What's interesting about this hot dog is some of the toppings are actually at the bottom. That's the crunchy onion. And the saucy ones are at the top. And the meat is not so processed, so it's not as gross as you would think like a hot dog would be in the United States. Okay, on to the next stop. We had amazing seafood. And the potato mash was something I've like never tasted before. Apparently it's a very common dish. Everyone kind of makes it their own way. Um, and you put it on this rye bread, which I was like, oh, rye, I don't know if I like it, but it was sweet. That was so good. And then we had that char that I mentioned before, but it was um, prepared with like honey and butter. That was really nice. I don't know how I'm gonna keep eating. We have two more stops on this tour, but I'm gonna keep plugging away. I'm gonna try fermented chard. It's not anything I really like wanted to do, but I'm gonna live in the moment. This is called Greenland um, Shark. It's been fermenting underground for like four months. So here it is. What it was, cheers. Scout. Oh, scout. But actually, it's okay. It's mild. I liked it before I started chewing it too much. Now I'm liking it. The more you it. chew, the I'm, worse it tastes. I'm liking it a little less. Um, I'm gonna use my napkin and then pass. <laughs> Here is something called Kleina, not to be confused with my last name. This is ice cream made of the rye bread that we had earlier, so I'm very interested in it. Kleina, which is like a donut that wasn't very sweet and not very exciting. That's the uh, church, must be 8.30 p.m. and look, it is still bright. But what I want to tell you about the rye bread ice cream, it was crumbly. Um, and almost like didn't even feel very cold. So the desserts so far have not blown me away. And that's the end of the food tour. Again, I highly recommend food tour. You actually get to know really cool people as well from all over. We had people in our group from Germany, from Spain, Argentina, Canada. All right, 